Welcome back. It's time to help find another adoptable dog, a new home. PTL viewers are the best at adopting featured pets in our Monday segments. Yeah, let's find one for today's pet named Rogue. She's here with Shannon Clark of Animal Friends on National Rescue <laughs> Dog Day. And we were saying hey. this morning, who rescued who, really? Right. Yes. right? Isn't it always like that, though? It is. Yes. 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 So much so. Yes. Okay, so tell us a little bit about Rogue here. She is a beauty, but she, a big one. She's, she's, she's sitting on your yeah, knee. she is. <laughs> 120 so pounds. She's, she's a lap dog, huh? Yeah, yeah. I mean, of course, right? Yeah. She's just taking a rest. Hi, bro. She's just hanging out. But this is Rogue. She's a great Dane. Uh, she is a very big dog, but she is so sweet. As you can see, she's <laughs> very comfortable right now. Um, she's about four years old, and she came to us through a rest, uh, partner that she was transferred to us, one of our partner shelters. Aww. Okay. And I'm surprised she's been with you so long because I, I know that these dogs, a lot of people are interested in mm -hmm. something that's like right, this right yeah and she specific can, breed right yeah and she can go home with kids that are six and older so she's a great Aww. family dog yeah but she wants to be the only pet right now but we are surprised that she's still with us because yeah. she's so sweet she's you can so tell. incredible so she would do oh oh but she doesn't like rye <laughs> <laughs> well she heard there might be rain in the forecast okay yes <laughs> You don't like rain in the forecast, you do don't you? Like rain. None of us do. We don't like it no. either. Ron, yeah. you're in trouble. It's okay. Okay. Oh no. It's okay. It's okay. Oh boy. Well, we we want to ask you too if Rogue is okay with it um, about the program for animals helping veterans. Right. Yes, we do have a whole targeted program. It's called Pets for Vets. Yeah. Rogue's very excited about that. Yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so fun. And we want. Oh, sorry. Yeah. No. It's fine. It's fine. Um, kind of like. In honor of Memorial Day, mm -hmm. but a lot of people don't know that Animal Friends actually started as a, an avenue of rescue for animals for soldiers going off to World War II. Oh wow! Oh, I didn't know that. So there wasn't really any options in Pittsburgh, so we were they were noticing that people, the soldiers, were just kind of opening their front doors and hoping for the best. Aww. And our founders saw this, founded Animal Friends, so this program was a great way for us to get back to our roots, and it's kind of like an honor of that. Um, but we have a lot of targeted programs for veterans to find them pets, and it's just any veteran or active duty member can get. Get waived adoptions. You get we waive the adoption uh, costs, but then we even have a more targeted one that works with veterans to match them specifically if they're suffering with PTSD or TBI. Right. So then we have trainers that go out find the animals, whether it's mostly dogs, sometimes cats or rabbits. Wow! Um, but they'll train the animal based on what the veteran needs. And then the veteran won't meet the animal though until match day. So that, those are some really, really great. So the training is free and the adoption fees are waived. Correct. What a great program. Right, right. Yeah. Well, and we've seen too through the therapy pets how much they can really exactly. help people. Right, right. So these yeah. so these animals that go through the program, it could be something like getting them used to a wheelchair or helping them with any, you know, it's it's really targeted to that specific veteran. They fill out they fill out an application because we're, we're the Pittsburgh chapter of the National Pets for Vets program. Very cool. So we have trainers that go out and work with the pets, and then we want to make sure that the veterans are matched with them so that everybody is happy as possible. Yeah, that's fantastic. Aww. Great job with that. Well, I'm looking forward to this uh, program at Perlora coming up this week. Yes. Yeah. yeah, and Thanks. Rogue has calmed down over the forecast. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yes. it's okay. There is going to be some sunshine. <laughs> Find out more about today's pet and the Pets for Vets program by visiting Animal Friends online or at the shelter on Camp Horn Road. And keep watching for more stories like this in our regular <laughs> Adopt Me segments every Monday right here on PTL.